Hello, this is Brett here. Today is going to be my first video of my tutorials on the Portals 2 authoring tools. So, today we're going to be learning about doors and how to get them. First, what you're going to do is the easiest way to get a door is we're going to do a test chamber door. I'm just going to click Entity Tool, take this, select it, double, double click it, and you're going to type in prop underscore test chamber door. Test. And the test chamber door should come up. Just apply, and then you're just going to give it some random name. So let's pick a name. So you can do like door one, or you can do like main door. So let's just go with main door. And then we're just going to turn it around. Oh, not that way. Right. Now, Doors can mainly go in walls, but uh, I'm going to be showing you how to put them in walls and make them neater. But instead of putting it in a wall, I'm just going to put it right here in the side. So we're going to move this over a bit, right here. And then to get the main panel, because it's hard to put this in a wall, because you can't really cover up because it's circular. So what we're going to do is we're going to go op File, Open, and you're going to find Zoo Mechanics. And you're gonna open it. Zoom Mechanics is like a main map full of functions and air nods and everything to like teach you how to make it. But so what we're gonna do is you're gonna come find a door and you're gonna find this panel. You're just gonna click on the panel like that. Then you're just gonna control C and then you're just gonna go file close. You're gonna come zoom out, just go like that, control V, put it there, double click on it. And then we're gonna apply uh, we want to turn this around. So I guess we're going to turn it around the old way. But I guess we're going to put it over here. So we're just going to move this back. And then all you're going to do is take this, drag it, not drag it, over here. Here, and we're going to put it right on top of this. Now we're going to go right in front of it so you can make it neat. Over here. We're going to make sure it's on the ground. Which it's not. Right down. That's on the ground now. Right, now that looks pretty good. Just a smidge of this way. Oh, you're not really going to see it. Oh, well, let's see. Alright, there we go. Now it looks good. Alright, so now the door's there. Now, how are we going to open the door? You can use triggers, pretty much anything, but we're just going to use a simple button. So we're just going to put an entity down. We're going to come here, delete this. I'm going to type in prop underscore button. I'm just going to give this name, uh, let's just call it Open Door. And then you're going to go to Outputs. We're going to Add. You go over here, Unpressed. And then you're going to go Main Door. And then you're going to find Open. And then click Apply. Now, when we join, we should be able to run. Let's see, there's Run. And then when you're running, it's going to put, you're going to click, you can either click F9 or File, Run. It's going to pop up this. This is only, is not important. We're going to click Expert Mode. Expert Mode actually loads it. We're going to go. We're going to wait a sec. It's going to compile. It's going to open portals too. Now we're going to wait a sec as it's loading the map. And here's the map. Now the map, now what it is, it looks like this. Looks like a normal door. And then you're just gonna click this. And there we go. Door's open. Now you can make triggers and stuff that close the door after you leave. You know how some test chambers, as soon as you walk out, they close. Well, we'll do that in another video uh, based off triggers. So that's how you make a door. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next video.